Welcome back to Infigyan friends. In this video, we are going to take up another interesting rational equation challenge. It is x plus 4 whole power 5 plus x plus 8 whole power 5 or x plus 5 whole power 5 plus x plus 7 whole power 5 equal to 11 square or 4 square. And we have to find out all real solutions. So let's get started. In numerator, there are two numbers written 4 and 8 in LHS. So I will take average of that. So it will give us 6. In denominator, there is 5 and 7 written. So if I will take average of that, then I will be writing 6. So our substitution would be x plus 6 equal to t. So x plus 4 will be t minus 2. x plus 8 will be t plus 2. So let's write our equation in the variable t. So I will write t minus 2 whole power 5 plus t plus 2 whole power 5 over denominator x plus 5. So it will be t minus 1. t minus 1 whole power 5 and x plus 7 would be t plus 1 whole power 5. And right hand side I will write 11 square. So it is 121. 4 square, so 16. Now I will use Pascal triangle and binomial expansion. So I need to draw Pascal triangle for power 5. So I will be writing 1, 1. For power 2, it is 1, 2, 1. For power 3, it is 1, 3, 3, 1. For power 4, it is 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. And for required power 5 is 1, 5, 10, 10, 5, 1. So here are our coefficients. So let me write here t plus 2 whole power 5. Then we will change the sign in between t minus 2. Okay. So I will be writing for coefficient 1. It would be t power 5. For coefficient 5, it would be 5 t power 4 times 2. For coefficient 10, it would be 10 t cube 2 square. For next coefficient 10, it would be 10 t square 2 cube. For next coefficient 5, it would be 5 t 2 power 4. And last coefficient 1, it would be 2 power 5. Okay. Now I will write the same for t minus 2 whole power 4. So where it is going to change? Let me change here itself. Alternate plus minus sign will be there. So minus here. Then I will write minus here. Then I will write minus here. Now let me write what I will get for our numerator. t plus 2 whole power 5 plus t minus 2 whole power 5. So this plus minus sign term will be eliminated, cancelled out once we will add both the binomial expansions. It is power 5. So let us do that. So I will be writing 2 times t power 5. Then I will write 10 t cube 2 square. So it is 40 t cube. And last term is 5 times 2 power 4, 16 times 5. It is 80 t. This is our numerator after simplifying it using Pascal triangle and binomial expansion. Now come to our denominator part where t minus 1 whole power 5 plus t plus 1 whole power 5 is written. So I will write first t plus 1 whole power 5 expansion. So it would be, remember our coefficient is 1, 5, 10, 10, 5, 1. Okay. So I will be writing here t power 5 for coefficient 1. For coefficient 5, it would be 5 t power 4. For coefficient 10, it would be 10 t cube. For coefficient 10, I will write it is 10 t square. Next coefficient 5, I will write 5 t. And last term is 1. Last coefficient is 1. So I will be writing 5t plus 1. 
Now once you will change sign for t minus 1 whole power 5 expansion, it is going to impact in the alternate. Here I will change sign, here I will change sign and last sign will be changed. Now let's write our denominator, the complete one. t plus 1 whole power 5 plus t minus 1 whole power 5. So this value will become 2 times. These terms will be left. First one, third one and the second last one, fifth one. So I will be writing in bracket t power 5 plus 10t cube plus 5t. Once numerator, denominator, both we have simplified. Now we will write our expression. So it was t plus 2 whole power 5 plus t minus 2 whole power 5 divided by t plus 1 whole power 5 plus t minus 1 whole power 5. It was minus first but it is same thing. And right hand side it was 121 over 16. Now I will write our simplified value. So that value was 2 times in bracket t power 5 plus 40 t cube plus 80 t and denominator was see it is written 2 times t power 5 plus 10 t cube plus 5 t and right hand side is 1 to 1 over 16. Now I can cancel this 2 first. Now I will take t common from this. Now one more thing we can talk about that is what will happen if t equal to 0 in this equation. If I will put t equal to 0 See, numerator will be 2 power 5 plus of minus 2 power 5. So, 0. Denominator will be 1 power 5 plus of minus 1 power 5. So, denominator will also be 0. That means 0 by 0 form in determinate state. We won't accept t equal to 0 as solution. So, I can take common t from the numerator, common t from the denominator and I can cancel t from the numerator denominator as t cannot be equal to 0. So let me take t common out first. So I will be writing here t. Let me write here. So here it is. Now I can see t and t will be cancelled out. So I will cancel it. Now cross multiply. So I will be writing here 121 times t power 4 plus 10 t square plus 5 equal to 16 times in bracket t power 4 plus 40 t square plus 80. Now let us take all the term to one side. So it will become 1 to 1 minus 16 t power 4. Then I will be writing for coefficient t square it will be 1 to 1 0 minus 640 t square and for constant I will be writing 605 minus 1280 equal to 0. So ultimately this equation will convert 105 t power 4. This value will be 570. So I will write 570 t square and if you will check this value this is coming out minus 675 equal to 0. Now number is coefficients are divisible by 5. So I will divide this equation with 5. So it will give us 21 t power 4 plus 114 t square minus I will write 135 equal to 0. Now again this equation is divisible by 3. So I will divide this equation by 3. So I will write here 7 t power 4 then it is 38 t square then it is 45 yes minus 45 equal to 0. So this is quadratic in t square. This equation is quadratic in t quadratic in t square. So I can 
directly calculate t square. So I will apply here Sridharachar formula. So let me write these equations and then apply quadratic formula. So I will write here 70 power 4 minus plus 38 t square minus 45 equal to 0. So I am calculating here t square directly using quadratic formula minus b plus minus under the root 38 square it is. So this value is 1444 minus 4ac. So 4 times 7 is 28 times 45. If you will calculate this value will be 1260 divided by 2a. So 14. Now you can see a square root value is coming out 2704. And this value is positive, that's why 2704 divided by 14. Now, square root of 2704 is 52. So, minus 38 plus minus 52 divided by 14. So, if I will consider plus sign in between, then it is 52 minus 38. 14 over 14. And once I will take minus sign, then it is 90 over 14 or negative 45 over 7. Now, t square cannot be negative for real solution. So, we will reject this one. Rejected. And which one we will accept? That is t square is equal to 1. So, t is equal to plus minus 1. This is the only possible solution in terms of t. Now what is t? t was our substitution x plus 6. So I will write here x plus 6 equal to plus minus 1. So x will be equal to minus 6 plus minus 1. Once I will take plus sign in between, then I will be writing minus 5. Once I will take minus sign, minus 7. So there are two real solutions, minus 5 and minus 7. Let's verify both. So I will write verification. x equal to negative 5. Okay, negative 5 plus 4. So negative 1 whole power 5 plus 8 minus 5, so 3 whole power 5 over negative 5 plus 5, so 0 plus 7 minus 5, so 2 power 5. This is our LHS. Now I will be writing minus 1 plus 3 power 5, 4 is 81, 5 is 243 divided by 2 power 5, which is 4 is 16, 5 is 32. So it is 242 over 32. So if I will cancel by 2, then it will become 121 over 16, which is 11 square over 4 square RHS. Now come to the second value of our solution that is x is equal to negative 7. This is verified. So let me write LHS negative 7 then minus 3 whole power 5 so i will be writing minus 243 plus 8 minus 7 whole power 5 so it is 1 power 5 1 divided by minus 7 plus 5 minus 2 raised to the power 5 minus 32 minus 7 plus 7 plus 0 so this value will come out minus 242 divided by minus 32 now minus and minus will be over. It is coming out again the same. 121 over 16 which is 11 square over 4 square. So this is also true value. So our real solution is x is equal to negative 5 and negative 7. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe friends. Bye bye till next video. Good luck.